why I like the Quester. Sometimes I just want to put a telescope easy to mount on the Dobsonian mount. I don't want to fiddle around with too many eyepieces, Barlow, then a finder scope. Everything in one package. That's Quester. That's what is all Quester about. And that gives me that option. So, easy observation. I just put one 10 millimeter, this in this case Hyperion, and I can just immediately start observing. Find the object, in this case Jupiter, and the Saturn, which is now here at the center, and continue to enjoy and immediately pack it up. You don't want sometimes to just really go for it putting a mount outside, tripod, carrying it out, carried it, carrying it in, uh, standing. This is this is tabletop and I'm sitting in the room and just enjoying the views. That's what it's all about. Comfort. This Comfort is especially important during the COVID, which we have to stay indoors and, you know, <clears throat> things are really not the way that they used to be. So, Questor has everything in a package, nice package that I want to use. That's the joy of the astronomy. It's not a chore. It's a joy. I especially like the ease that you can change between the finder and looking, centering the object and immediately putting the eyepiece on the, um, on the train and you can just see it. Then immediately if you want you can increase the magnification by this parlor. Really easy. I don't know why nobody has actually tried to improve on that, just make uh, similar things. Uh, is it patented? But there must be other ways to actually go around this and just make it use, uh, accessible to everyone. With this setup, this field question is as easy as one, two, three. <laughs> it's just one, two, three. That's it. I found the object. I'm already looking at it. <laughs> I'm now watching the uh, observing the Saturn. I wonder how it is with the quest or with a standard mount. That would be lovely. If I can get a, a duplex mount, that would be nice. But I have already this one, so I can just use the cheap Dobsonian mount. One of the things that puts off me with the Celestron like that or unguided, uh, uh, no go to uh, meet, is that it takes ages sometimes to even find the moon. <laughs> with that but this is this is so lovely the finder immediately changes to the eyepiece you can find anything you want in a snapshot